Hey y'all, so today's video is going to be sponsored by OMG Her Hair, where this hair is definitely out of this world. So in your package, you'll get an elastic band and also a wig cap and this amazing 6 to 8 inch pixie cut lace front bob wig. This is 100% Indian Remy hair and you will get two combs in the front on the napes. you also get a comb and in the middle, you'll also get a comb. So a total of four combs along with that, an adjustable strap and an elastic band. So prior to this video, I did wash the hair and I did bleach some of the knots and pre-plucked the unit. However, it does come bleached for you and it also does come pre-plucked. But you guys already know how I like to do, so I just did my own little spin on things. So before you put your wig on, girl, make sure that you cut the lace off as you guys see me doing here. I prefer to use smaller size scissors, but you know what? Everyone has their preference, so do what's good for you, girl. I do you, boo. When you're cutting the lace, I would highly suggest not to cut too close to the hairline as you don't want any of the hair to fall out in the long run. So try not to cut too close, just leave yourself a little bit of wiggle room. Now what I'm doing now is making sure that the wig fits properly and it's just a little too big on the sides but that's standard with any size wig cap, especially if it's an average medium stock size as sometimes these may not fit properly so you do want to make sure to customize them. So what I do is I'll just take a hair clip as you guys see here and then I'll take my rat tail comb and I'll part that above my ear just that way the hair does not or the lace does not flap or lay over my ear I'm gonna take my small scissors once I've made my part as you guys see here that's a straight part and I'm just going to cut off that excess lace don't be afraid to cut off any of the lace because you do want to make sure that your wig fits properly and also lace flat to your head this will allow your wig to look a lot more natural So now that I went ahead and cut off that extra piece of lace, I'm going to go ahead and make me some sideburns. You're definitely going to need them with a pixie cut. And you guys already know, this is something short and different for me. So just to adhere my wig, just temporarily, I'm just going to take some of my Got To Be Glam Force hairspray and apply that right where you see me do that. And I'm also going to be taking a blow dryer and drying that product. If you don't have a blow dryer, no worries. This product does dry really quick, but I would advise not to spray too much at one time. Allow small sections to dry at a time. And if you do have a blow dryer, then go ahead, girl, take your blow dryer out and get to blow drying, okay? So once you went ahead and made your sideburn hairs, you can do an optional step, which is just making you some wispy or baby hairs. So that is what I'm gonna do right now, but prior to that, I'm just gonna take some of that hairspray, which is the Glam Force by Got To Be, and I'm going to spray that onto the lace. Now keep in mind, the hair will not get hard if you spray behind your wispy hairs or baby hairs. Or if you wanna take an extra step, you can just spray it underneath your cap, on the edges of the wig so that way it'll stick as well but either way the got to be glam force hairspray works amazing it'll give you quite a few days of hold and you can always pick this up at Ulta now just to make the wig look just as natural and a little bit more natural I'm just going to cut down some of those baby hairs or wispy hairs whatever you want to call them and then I'm going to complete the style onto the opposite side by just doing the same thing which is cutting the sideburns and creating the baby hairs as well
All right, y'all, so let's get to styling this bad boy. So for this wig to be six to eight inches, I actually really do like it. It was really easy to style. I have never gotten a lace front wig that was this short before. But I do like short hair. Sometimes I like it even shorter than this. It kind of gave me like this more mature look, not as in old, but just a little bit more mature look. And I'm glad that it did not age me. But if you don't like the length, you can definitely customize it. You can make it shorter. So that's the one good thing about this unit, that it is 100% Indian Remy hair. And you can customize it to your liking. You can shorten it and you can use heat to it. And did I forget to mention, the wig is under $100. Girl, this wig is $79. The wig is now $68. Okay. You do get fast shipping, three to five day delivery service as well as that as the processing time is super quick, okay? And let me not forget to mention, this is the third anniversary for omgherhair.com. So congratulations to them for being around three solid years and more to come. So make sure you check out their website. They have so many amazing units that are at affordable prices. So I'm just gonna continue to style this. As you guys see, I'm just spraying some of my hairspray onto my toothbrush because I really don't want the hairs, like the baby hairs, to get crunchy or hard. So that is just one of my easy methods. Plus it also allows the hair a lot easier to just swoop it, you know, to control it. But I think she's rather cute, you know what I'm saying? I think she's really good for work, especially in the summer heat. But for those of you ladies who love short hair, then you definitely have to check out this picture. And now for a view of the back, as you guys see, it is kind of layered. I could have did a little bit better on the back portion, but you know what I'm saying? I think she's rather cute. The hair is super soft, very flowy. And like I stated, it all depends on how you style this pixie wig. So you guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. All of the information will be down below. Make sure you check out OMG Her Hair for their third anniversary sale. Bye.